Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode from How to Webmaster. Today I am reviewing my RK plugin. This is a WordPress plugin that allows you to build a website just like this right here. It is an arcade site where people can come and play flash games for free. And I will uh, play a game later on near the end of the video just to show you guys how that works. But this is great for gamers and anybody looking to add more entertainment to their website by offering free games that people can play directly on their browser or on their phone. And of course, this is WordPress, so you can also have a blog on your site and blog about gaming reviews, tutorials, and things like that. So here is the plugin, my arcade plugin. You can get it from Cold Canyon in Wato Market. I've actually used this for many years. And the best thing about this plugin is that there's a lot of game, literally thousands of games you can download to your website. And they are all free. And also you can automatically post new games to your website daily or hourly. So which means you don't have to manually add new games, type in the title, description, and manually download it, and upload it. Everything is um, automatic and free. So here's my WordPress dashboard. And if you don't know how to use WordPress, I have a whole tutorial series on that. So basically my RK plugin comes with a plugin and a theme. So first you want to add the plugin which I already did. And it's really simple. All you have to do is click on upload plugin and then choose the R my RK plugin zip file and upload it. And then the same thing with the theme. All you have to do is click on add new theme and then upload theme and then choose the my RK plugin Theme. There's two of them. There's a fun games 24. They have different layouts, but I use the their newest default theme. I think it's the best uh, looking. It's newer. So first thing you want to do is click on settings for my arcade right here, and the settings are pretty straightforward. There's really simple instructions in the general settings like save user scores do you want to click yes save only high score yes or no and here's the instructions for that uh, gaming type you can make this exclusively for mobile devices only or just allow all types pc or computers and mobile it will download both kind of games uh, how many games should be published when you publish games post status if you want to manually review all the games first before you post or publish it you can do that or you can draft it or you can schedule it or publish it do you want to download the games to your server so this can take a lot of space so I just select no on this one so that way it's hosted on their own servers not yours and it saves you a lot of bandwidth and disk space I only download the screenshots since uh, that doesn't take too much space. And here's the automation part, the cron settings. So yes, game fetching, fetch new games hourly, and then automatically publish the games uh, twice daily. And here's the game categories. They have a lot of categories you can choose. You can make a website based on like action games only, board games only. Uh, dress up game, driving car games. So you can make a lot of uh, like a niche arcade site. And you can set up custom uh, categories if you want. A custom uh, game description. Just to make it a little bit more unique. Allow people to post games. Allow guest plays until they register or not. You can leave zero so they can have unlimited plays. And then make sure to save 
And then another good thing is translation. You can translate it. And category mapping, you can uh, create custom categories and say like action games, you can make it uh, into a different uh, name if you want. Advanced features is like resetting your database, delete all the games and things like that. So here's the game feeds. So we have quite a few you can choose from. And it's pretty much already set up for you. Just yes, you want to fetch the game, how many games you fetch, and automatic, allow automatic game publishing, yes. So for most of these, you can, you can just click uh, yes to allow for fetching and publishing. And that's pretty much it for the game feeds. And now let's head over to fetch games. And like I said before, you can set uh, my arcade plugin to fetch games automatically for you already and also publish it so you don't have actually have to do this manually. But if there's any particular kind of games you want, like uh, tower defense games, I like tower defense. So you can see if there's any tower defense kind of game. So if there's no, no uh, tower defense. So here we have some at Congregate. So we have a few right here and you can play the game. So you can click here to play it on your browser and you can edit on the spot as well. Like the game description, game instructions, tag, and you can categorize it or you can publish it right now or draft it. So let's go ahead and publish it. So there it is, publish. And you can view that in your post. Dungeon Defender right there, six seconds ago. And let's reload. I'm not sure where it, it is going to show up. Right here, Dungeon Defenders. There it is. So let's go back to Game Fetching and then Publish Games. It's kind of similar. How many games you want to publish at this moment or schedule it. Let's see, nine game posts. So right now, if I click on Create Post, it's creating nine new games. It's going to publish nine new games right now. So it is running. So that was pretty fast. All done. It took 11 seconds. So right now, if I refresh, so it's actually scheduled. I didn't put uh, publish now. So I. I should have uh, put publish. It, it'll all be published, but right now, see, th there's nine new schedule. Randomly, it's gonna be published on these dates: the fourth, May the fourth, on the fifth, sixth, seven, eight, nine, and you can set the the time schedule right here. So that's pretty cool. But again, I already told you this can all be automatically done. You don't have to touch a thing, and set the ads. Go over to appearance, theme options, and again, it's really straightforward. Theme option, general settings. You want the sidebar left or right. You want smooth scrolling, sticky sidebar. You can leave these mostly default. It doesn't matter too much. And again, you can go through each one of these and customize it however you want. But here is the advertisement banner options. So we have the header, uh, the frip style layout, the banner content, the pre-game banner, and I'll show you these later in the game. So right here we have the header, 728 by 90, and another one right here. And you can add more on the sidebar if you want. It comes out of the box pretty much already, like almost perfect. And you can change the entire uh, the, the color of the entire website right here in styling. You can have a let's see the default theme. I think that's the the bright white kind. Let's refresh. There it is. If you like the white color looking, you can do that. So that's pretty much it. Uh, I mean, that's a whole bunch of settings you can go through, but uh, you can do that to customize your RK site to however you like. And of course, there's the posts and pages. You can add new blog posts, 
add new pages if you want but for the most part that's how you set up the arcade gaming and now let's play a game to see how that looks so here is the, the game page and you can see the banner ads right here the 728 and the pre-game and then the game is loaded you click on play now and it's gonna load up some other stuff and again there's nothing to download or install your viewers can play the game directly on their browser so let's click start and uh, let's see let's do championship mode and then they play the game directly on the browser just like this and there's thousands of games to play that you can fetch from all kinds of niche you can make all kinds of gaming uh, niche shooting games action games sport games it's up to you so that's how you do it uh, how to set up a fun free flash RK WordPress site especially if you're a gamer you should uh, I mean this will add a lot of entertainment value to your viewers and uh, it's my RK plugin. I'll leave the link down below for you guys to check out. Thanks so much for viewing. Let me know if you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, tips. Please be sure to subscribe to How to Webmaster for more internet marketing tips, tricks, and tutorials and reviews. And until next time, happy marketing.